Ben McDishley Kid. I'm a young patriot who loves history and New Jersey tourism. In episode two, I'll be taking you on two popular New Jersey tourist attractions and one restaurant. I got a good one in mind for that. Our first stop today is Northlands in Flemington, New Jersey. You're probably asking yourself, what's Northlands? Well, my friends, it's the biggest, coolest model railroad in the world. Up to 100 trains travel more than 8 miles of track and 40-foot bridges spin huge canyons. You think I'm dreaming? I'll prove it to you. Let's go inside and check it out. You think this is great? You haven't seen nothing yet. Bruce Williams began his hobby in 1972 when his first house was built. His basement was where he built his first mountains for his train set. In 1977, Mr. Williams hosted an annual train show for a local charity, and the rest is history. You cannot believe the detail Mr. Williams put into his recreations. When you come to Northlands, make sure you hear Mr. Williams play his organs. down. This is the town of Northlands. Mm -hmm. 
When you come to Northlands, you can ride an 1890 replica narrow gauge steam train. This is family fun for kids of all ages. Northlands is truly a spectacular world of its own. Famous people from Neil Young to Pee Wee Herman have been here, and now you can too. If you live in New Jersey or planning vacation here, you have to visit Northlands and tell them Nick the History Kid sent you. Now it's time to go to the parkway and to the Jersey Shore. I'm now in Point Pleasant Beach at Jenkinson's Boardwalk. Summer is here and this is the place to be. If you've never been here before, then let's go. This is what I call a totally fantastic Jersey Shore location. Charles Jenkinson first opened a soda fountain in Asbury Park in Ocean Grove in the early 1900s. In 1926, he bought property here in Point Pleasant, New Jersey, and by 1928, Jenkinson's Pavilion opened for business. There's plenty of fun-filled family activities to do here. You may want to try your luck with a frog. Jenkinson's Boardwalk is about a mile-long destination with a variety of attractions for the whole family. There's an aquarium, an amusement park, arcades, three mini golf courses, batting cages, and sweet shops. restaurant review is right here at Jenks. Boardwalk favorites including pizza, burgers, cheesesteaks, and my dad's favorite, sausage sandwiches. At the Pavilion restaurant, they also have a raw bar. You can have a shrimp cocktail, clams, oysters, and sushi by the sea. I love the clams. can get down and eat all this horseradish. Especially at Jenkinson's. You usually have to go to Florida Myrtle Beach to play on a golf course like this. But then again, this is Jenkinson's boardwalk right here in Point Pleasant Beach, New Jersey. Everything done right, everything done for you. Today's your lucky day at Jenkinson's Boardwalk. Hey, girls! Jenkinson's Aquarium opened in 1991 and has proven to be a valuable educational and recreational resource and is dedicated to educating the public on all aspects of marine life and conservation. Let's check it out.
exhibits such as Atlantic sharks, Pacific sharks, coral reefs, penguins, alligators, and seals give you the opportunity to get up close to animals from around the world. Did I tell you I love seals? If you want a fun-filled day at the Jersey Shore with your family and without Snooky, then come to Jenkinson's Boardwalk in Point Pleasant Beach. See you next time. Until then, remember my state slogan, New Jersey, from the Revolutionary War to the Jersey Shore, both history and fun awaits you.